At the start of battle in his first form, Bunavelza casts Doom. So be fast about the whole thing. Whatever staggers and damages the fastest is your friend. For Garb, Soldier of Peace is a great choice for one of them because it converts Heavy Slash to Artemis's arrow. But I ended up going with Nocturne, Equilibrium, and Carnival Crusher. In any case, you want a varied list of spells, especially Wind, along with Heavy Slash for the deep damage. My selection included Aurora, Arrow, Ice Spark, Flame Spark, Fira, and Blazara. Elements and Elementa are also handy if you use them wisely. For accessories, stick with ones that guard against Defaith and Debrave. When God flings his scythe at you, make sure to guard it as quick as it comes. Fling spells as fast as you can, sticking with wind when possible, and slash him to bits when he's staggered. Hopefully, the first form shouldn't give you too much trouble. This is your grave! I will win. In Bunavelz's second form, the elemental attacks start. Dealing with things like Aurora and Thundara aren't so bad, but you'll need to prepare to guard precisely against attacks like Wings of Destruction. Watch for Bunavelz's elemental forms. For instance, when he transforms with Wind Spirit, shoot electricity his way. So remember the paired elements. Wind versus Lightning and Lightning versus Wind, Fire versus Ice and Ice versus Fire. Hammer him hard with magic when he casts Genethliac Him, and don't be sad if you don't stagger him before he explodes with Dancing Mad, though you can effectively block much of the damage if you're really, 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 really good. Kills me. Humanity will be the 
final victor. Drowning chaos! Drowning chaos! Hang in there, we're now to Bunavelz's third form. In some ways, it's like the first, although he's a lot more powerful now. Again, spell him to death. Arrow and Aurora are my favorite, staggering him with some sense of expediency. This is where your guarding abilities receive their final test, given God's willingness to throw his weapon around all willy-nilly. As for the hypernova attack, well, best to have some X-potions on you. That attack is a real doozy. Now feel my strength. Wretched fool.
Now, Bunavels is final form. You're going to want to go into it with a full EP meter and any leftover ethers you have. And the reason is because he takes almost no damage at first. You have to stagger him. And the best way to do that is to fling spells at him as fast as you can. The best way to make that happen easily is to use Overclock. And so activate Overclock as often as you can until he is staggered. Once he's staggered, just slash him up, and he'll go down. Just be careful of some of his attacks. The biggest one to keep an eye on is Heartless Angel, in which he summons forth two angels that take away almost all of your health, leaving a single HP. Guard as soon as the camera focuses on lightning to block that particular attack. Also, be careful not to accidentally activate Army of One when you are using Overclock. As long as you overclock a lot and use ether if you need to build up more EP, you should be okay. Even if it kills me. This is your grave! Ah! 